Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Oman Garden Fix and Tricks. I'm Nikola. In today's video, um, clearly those who watch the channel can see that I'm in my backyard. But I have something that I want to bring to your attention from the title of the video. You can see what I'm going to discuss today. So I have these, you know that I'm a bee farmer, right? I'm only bee farmer. So I have those two bees box. One, two in the yard in the backyard they are those new colony that i always keep at hand so if i get an emergency call that i need to go and collect a colony i can just go and collect it quickly yesterday Jaden, she's my son he called my attention and to bees bees and he was saying that daddy there's some bees in the box so i came out thought it was a swarm in there i looked and i realized that what the bees were doing is what we refer to as coating so you see them now what they are currently doing is not a swarm in the box and by the way no bees were in the box before they were just empty boxes right but these bees are really worker bees that are called scout bees they are, they are workers that are called scouts so what they will do they go out in the field and if their original hive is getting overcrowded they will scout out new location to establish a new colony and when they scout so sometimes they will take three four days sometimes a week even more than that and scout out the area right and once they scout out that spot they will then go back to the colony and communicate that direction and that location rather and then they will remove half of that colony so that colony will be reduced to half its original size so you'll have what they call a split or a swarm develop so what will happen eventually is that a colony of bees a swarm of bees will come in this box so i am waiting patiently and i am waiting for them because it is at this point it is inevitable it is inevitable that a swarm will happen or will occur so i am waiting and that you know that is money that is money so i am waiting ladies and gentlemen see them there coming in and out so they are scouting Shortly, these bees will go away. So by in the evening, they will go away. Go back to their original hive. And in the morning, they will come back and scout again. So, and see them looking in that one over there too, you know. So them, they are mostly in this one. So I think they like this one. Maybe it's the position. So when they scout, what they look for? They look for an open cavity. Right? So they measure. The worker bees actually have a measuring um, ability. I don't know how they do it. You need to do some study on that. But they actually measure the depth, the length, the width of the area. So the, the volume of the area, they measure it to see if it can accommodate their new swarm. Right? And to see if the area is comfortable, free from pests and so forth. And then they will come. So see them? It is inevitable. Right? They will come. So at this point now, it's just a waiting game. It's waiting on them. And when after I catch this one, I'm going to put that box over there in this location and I will catch another swarm right here. So this is how you catch a swarm. Well, it is not a complete swarm as yet because remember it's just a scouting process. But as I said, at this point, it is inevitable. It is inevitable. So I'm just waiting. Thank you very much. Remember to subscribe to the channel, like the videos, share it with your friends and family. For Oman Garden Fix and Tricks, I'm Nikal. Peace.